first class we're actually this oh train already left good it's a good thing I got on let's see if there's anyone actually on this train because I don't I don't think I recall seeing anyone on the train hello I'm not the I am passenger would you like to hear short stories of Kevin hello I know I saw someone on this train earlier there was like a lady I went past like some toilets and there was like a lady or am I thinking of something else oh no 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 there we are hey would you like to hear short stories of Kevin would you like to hear some short stories I'll look at me if you want to hear short stories of Kevin ah oh, oh you do oh you're looking out the window okay may may maybe you don't would you like to hear short stories of Kevin ah yes short stories of Kevin let's tell you okay right in year seven forgot his P oh this is a British one sweet right in year seven, forgot his PE shorts. Not forgot to bring them, forgot to put them on. He went outside in the middle of winter without his shorts. I've done that. When I was in um, primary school, in like, I think year two, um, we didn't do PE outside, we did it inside. And I just forgot to put my PE shorts on and I was just sat there in like a vest and my pants. And I was just like, oh God. But then again, I was a small child. So, you know, I can get away with that kind of shit. Right, forgot his PE shorts, not forgot to bring them, forgot to put them on. He went outside in the middle of winter without his shorts, and it took 20 minutes for him to realise he wasn't wearing his PE shorts before running back in. During a geography lesson, if anyone doesn't know what that is, it's basically studying the world. Um, during the geography lesson, he yelled out interlocking spurs while sliding his fingers in between each other. Not only did this have nothing to do with the subject the teacher was talking about, the teacher had all... Wait. The teacher was not... was talking about the teacher had also not asked a question. Okay. Um, generally thought that Japan was a city and was the capital of China. It took half an hour to prove otherwise. Yeah, but when I was young, you can't. You see, these aren't really stupid things, to be honest. They're just like minor things. I mean, I thought New York City was in Japan. So you know, I'm an idiot too. Then I, I am, I am, I am Kevin. God, I, I hate you so much, Kevin. Right. Thought dogs and cats were the male and female of the same species. No. Got stabbed by sewing by a sewing needle and textiles and proceeded to finish sewing the material before getting out. <laughs> Tried to hit me with a glue stick from across the room. However, I was behind four people and he attempted to curve the glue stick. He somehow missed me and hit two other people. Finally, he stole the caretaker's golf cart thing and then almost immediately drove it into the pond near the school field and hit three geese. Oh, what? Okay. Right. A very close call with my Kevin roommate. Okay. <laughs> this is what this is. I'm literally just going to re read stuff about Kevin. Anyway, did you like that story? Yeah? I actually quite like what you're wearing, to be honest, because that's what I would wear. Also, you do realize you're the only person on this train. I haven't, I've, like, found no one else. Right. Anyone else? No, there's literally no one else on this train. It's just me and that lady. If this was the real world, then... Oh, wait, yeah, it's like 7 in the morning. All right, yeah, I'll, I'll let that lady off. I'm at the bottom of the train now. Staff access only. I'm staff! All right, textures are messing up a bit there. Sit in standard class, no fucking way. Do you know who I am? Right. Open the door. Open the door. Right. A very... Yeah, a very close... Let's get back to my first class seat. I'm not going to sit with the scrubs. Yeah, lady, you're literally the only one. Apart from me, you're the only one left. So, yeah. Good luck. Right, let's go back to my first class seat because, you know, I deserve it. Right, where, where are we? Right, we are over halfway now. And we stopped at one stop. Okay. Um, not sure if we're going to stop at wherever that is. But I'm liking this free roam aspect. I, I really am. I'm liking, I'm liking this game. I've seen reviews, I've watched a load of views and, reviews and they're all like, Oh, this game's actually pretty trash because, you know, you don't have enough lines. But you can buy lines, which I'm going to be doing for Christmas. I'm going to be buying 
one. I'm only going to buy the one because I don't want to go too overboard. I need to save my money. But I'm going to just buy one. That's not the seat I wanted. But it'll do. Right, let's look at the beautiful views. A very close call with my Kevin roommate. I've lived with this Kevin for over two years and she does a lot. Oh, it's a she now. Does a lot of things that make me wonder how she's still alive. This was last year when we had an extra roommate to help with the rent. This roommate happened to be a recently graduated physicist working for some Department of Defense contractor in the area. Basically the opposite of a Kevin. Quite polite, uh, quiet, polite and chock full of common sense. Me and physicist roommate worked quietly in the kitchen when Kevin comes down the stairs. You can tell who it is because she incredibly loudly without trying to or even know it without trying or even notice. She announced that she was reheating her leftovers for dinner. I saw Kevin take her food wrapped in aluminium foil out of the fridge and put it in the counter. Whatever, right? Wrong. We have a toaster oven and a microwave sitting right next to each other on the counter. You would think that Kevin would put her leftovers in the toaster oven to heat them up without getting soggy. But no. I look up again just in time to see her put the aluminium foil wrapped leftovers into the microwave. I immediately tell her to stop and ask what she's doing. Kevin gives me a look and says she's heating up her leftovers. Physicist roommate has also looked over at this point and is also alarmed. We both tell her she can't put metal in the microwave that she could absolutely break the micro microwave and quite... Oh, that's it. It just ends there. Wow. Okay. I used to work with a guy who actually did do this. I came into the kitchen to find him stomping on the flaming remains of a Wendy's burger. He was lucky the owner of the company was just about to remodel the kitchen because it burnt and melted a hole in the kitchen carpet. Carpet in the kitchen? What kind of mad... <laughs> yeah, who puts carpet in a kitchen? Um... Papier is made out of wood. No. Former co-worker was a Kevin... Another story about the water. Oh, what? What? Okay. Another story about the watermelon fucker. Content warning. Injury. Watermelon. Sex. Okay, so there's a TLDR. Um, on a Boy Scout camp out, he decided he didn't like being teased by a couple... By a troop near us, snuck into their camp and filled a watermelon with his seed in a bizarrely poetic juxtaposition. So, this is a shorter story. Okay. So, why is it not? I want to see the full thing. Yeah, can I can I see the full thing, please? Okay, it's not showing me the full thing. Um, I don't want to do the app. Uh, there's no point doing that one because it won't show me the full thing. Right, okay. Neither is this one. Why are they not showing me the full thing? I don't want to see... No, I want to see the full... Uh, whatever. Right. I think I'm done with Reddit stories now. Right, we're getting so close to London. In one recording session. This normally would have taken me, like... In the previous game, it would take me a, a while. But because, you know, I was driving and I was doing all the speed limit stuff. Can I actually go into... Oh, no, I can't because it's one of them big ones. I can't actually go into the thing. So I can't go into there. Which I've always wanted to know what was inside there, but okay. Window, ducky down, whatever, right. So we're almost done like a full route. I drove a little bit of it, and then I did passengering for like the rest of it. And I've got 10 minutes left on my recording session because the PlayStation only allows me to record for 60 minutes. So, yeah, right, anyway. Um, but you can't like go into the toilets. Right, I think, I don't know if we'll be stopping at another station soon. I honestly don't know. I think we might be. Or are we not? Are we on, like, the far line? No, I think we might be stopping. Because it does sound like we're slowing down, but there's no other trains around. So I can't just, like, stop and get on. Is that my original train? No, it can't be, because it didn't come past us. Where is my original train? Going on a search. Because, yeah. I don't think that's my original train. I think that one is. Which is quite far away. And I'm glad I didn't stay on that one. Because I would have been going on every single stop. So, yeah. We're going pretty fast. Right. We're going on a trip. 
found a passenger train. This is what I wanted to do for the first episode. I literally just wanted, but the first episode is obviously the tutorial, so I can get grips on the game. But I wanted to do um, like an entire session of just me playing the game, but doing like random, just this, just passenger and reading Reddit stories. Because that's all I wanted to do. Seems it it seemed fun in my head, and it is fun to me. I am I will. What I will do next time, if I do another passenger passenger episode, I will get, like, actual good Reddit stories. Why isn't this door closing? I don't know. But I will get good passenger stories, like, actual stories. Maybe stories about people on trains. I don't know. I might have to stop the recording and start it again, because I don't think I'm going to get to London in time for, um for my recording to end, so I might have to stop and start the recording. No, I don't want to go in this seat. I don't like sitting backwards on trains. I don't like sitting backwards on trains. I don't like sitting backwards on trains. Stop making me sit. Stop it. No, I don't like it. No. Why are you doing this to me? No. This is bull. This is bullshit. Why? Why? Why can't I just... I'd like to sit forward, please. This isn't fair. And we're getting so close to London now. I think I may even get there in time for my recording to end. Because, you know. Might do. Right. Let's go check in on Blue Lady. Hello? Blue Lady? Is there any trains at that station that I can just like hop on nope there's literally none because it's early morning isn't it I should have changed the day to like midday that way it'd be super busy but yeah I've missed this oh no there'll be one there and that'll take me back to somewhere else so where am I catching up to that bugger yeah we're catching up to you we're gonna get you you're gonna get beat up by my train Salty Stephen and the Fanny Wagons. Yeah, that's right. I called myself Salty Stephen and the Fanny Wagons. Yeah. So, I'm not sure. I haven't recorded any yet, but I've got GTA 5 now, so I'm going to install that at some point. And then, again, I'm sitting backwards and I'm not happy about it. But um, I've got GTA 5 now, so I'm going to install that and do the online because I've got PS Plus, which is cool. So I'm going to use some PS Plus to... Um, have a have a fun fun field time back on the online version of GTA. I'm gonna be so happy. I can finally get back to Captain Sexy Pants and that. But those episodes have probably already come out and they might be with Connor and they might not be. I don't know, but we'll find out. I'm gonna set that to install tonight and then come Christmas morning I will play play that. So yeppers. Never saying yep. Why do I keep saying yeppers? It's not even a word. I think it's just something I've come up with. Put it on a shirt. Right, where are you going? Okay, you're going up into one of those like tiny little station slots, and I am going to <coughs> cough, and then I'm gonna just yeah. I've literally done what I wanted to do. I've done like the full line, and I've done um. Yeah, I've done I've done the full line. I want to get on my chair now. Right, there we go. I've done the full line. I kind of want to get off the train now. I've had a, I've had a, I've had a long journey. I wish the journeys were longer though. I wish I wish we literally did have a journey from um, London to Bristol. I would like that, but I'm happy with what I got. There is a a line that I do want, which I'm probably I'm gonna have a look at some of the. Um, a downloadable content that you can get the add-ons because um, apparently you can get like some other lines and one that's like slightly an older line and it's not an up-to-date modern line like this like this and it actually it's a place I've been to so I'll be here right in my element no I don't want to sit there I sit by myself but I want to sit the other way I don't get what's going on here and I say oh there we go okay I can finally sit forward right we're coming into the station which is great. I 
done a full line. I've gone from Reading all the way to London. I'm happy with that. We'll see the other train in a minute. It'll be on the uh, left side. And if you look to your left, you'll see a fucking train that uh, got here before us because it's a fucking small bastard. It's what you are. Right. Entering Paddington. There it is. There's that little bugger. Should I hop on that one? No. And I've got time to spare for my recording. So, yay. I'm happy for that. I managed to get this done in like 50 minutes. Which is pretty fast. Wow. I was here earlier. Anyway, I'm going to uh, get off the train. I've done my journey now. So I need to get off my seat. I can't get off my seat. There we go. Let's get to the door. Yo, blue, blue girl. Come on. It's time to get off. It's time to get off. Finally, they, they answered my prayers and gave me passenger simulator. Yes. <laughs> okay, shut. I want to I wanna get out. I want to get out. Open the doors. Open the doors. Yes! Finally! We did it! We're here! Ah, pity I can't jump. I want to jump for joy. Uh, but I did it! Came all the way, did the whole line in passenger mode. <laughs> Sweet. Anyway, um, I think that's going to be it for me today. So I'm going to go check out the add ons and see what I can get. Or see, see what deals they have, because I think Christmas time they have deals. So yeah, I'm going to go. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next episode of Train Sim 2020. Oh, I'm going to have so much fun with this game for a long time. Bye!